Hey, my beautiful collective, welcome to Scorpio Intuitions. If this is your first time on my channel, like and subscribe, hit that notification button. And if this is not your first time, hey, family, welcome back. So we're going to dive into this energy. Most high, I thank you right now for my beautiful, powerful collective. I thank you for their life, their purpose, and their very being. Anything that is trying to hinder them or uh, create blockages, we ask for it to be removed. Victory is our portion. We walk in it, we receive it, it is so. Okay, so let's see what's, what's for us. What's coming for us most high? We're going to get this right here. This deck feels like a winner. Messages of love and light for my beautiful, powerful, sexy Scorpio. Messages of love and light. Ooh, okay. Collect. Ooh. <laughs> All right, so the first thing we have is the world card, family. At this time, it's an energy of uh, being being able to have access to everything around the world. Uh, it's like either either the business that you're doing is like starting to get more more clients from different parts of the world that that maybe maybe you haven't had um, customers from there, or it's like people. Uh, I just feel like. People have access to seeing you, to appreciating you at this time. It's something that you're doing. You're looking very beautiful. I feel like new things are starting to take place. There could be a lot of uh, travel, future travels, um, retraveling some places. I feel that right now it's a, it's like a glowing energy. And then we have the Empress here. So we have the world in the Empress. This is expansion. Somebody, if this is dealing in business, your business is expanding to all over the world. Like a lot of you guys are becoming international. Hey, congratulations, Scorpio. Scorpio International. Oh. <laughs> so yes, and the Empress right here, it's like, the Empress is a nurturing, expansive uh, energy. It's like this is a pregnancy energy because you're expanding. You'll be bringing uh, forth a new life. This is an energy of growth because the because the Empress embodies all four all four queens. So this is overall uh, self knowing, self self uh, knowledge, and because they're both major arcana of uh, cars collective there's major things happening right now and let me just remind you today is august 8th the full moon and spoke the beginning energy of of lion's gate can i just say uh the portal is open and victory 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 is here family so step on up and let's go <laughs> messages of love light and power some of you all are leaving mental uh situations that used to keep you in your head about something family um friends just like i feel like in some things it was pertaining to work it was like little things now you're just not letting bother you the things that used to bother you before or like like they used to trigger you or get under your skin you just like man fuck that shit i am not about to deal with it today it's that energy of releasing things that used to trouble you and i'm really moving forward in a massive way I feel, spirit says that there's an energy of just seeing which direction you want to go because it, it, it's like Scorpio, you got to this point to where it's no denying that you are great. It's no denying that you are in this, like everything you touch is blessed family. It's like people really feel like Scorpio lucky as hell. You feel me? Yeah, you know, you can call it lucky, you call it blessed, but whatever. And now it's like, it's like, which part of the world do you want to conquer now? What is your next, uh, what, what's next on the bucket list? It's like, you have all your resources to do everything that you ever wanted to do in life, Craig. Oh, you know, the resources to get it done. Now it's like, okay, what's next on the bucket list? And it's like, you knocking it out. Boom. You say you're going to do this. Boom, boom, boom. Knock it out. Boom. What's next? Boom, boom, boom. What's next? That's, this is what's next. You just... Messages of love, light, and power from my beautiful Scorpios. Got this energy, Scorpio, of like, I got this. Spirit says you're about to be very busy with this two of uh, pinnacles. There's an energy of um, a lot of work. I don't know. I feel like you're going to be traveling. This is a, a energy of, because first we have the world card. Then we have this, this ship. 
So a lot of you guys could be going on cruises, could be taking a boat to a particular place, could go to a place somewhere that's overseas. And, and it's going to be about mind. I feel like it's going to be uh, expansive. It's going to be bringing you wealth. Whatever you're traveling for is bringing you in wealth. And I feel like you have more things coming in for you. So Scorpio, Spirit is saying like while you guys are busy working and, and just, you know, continually expanding because you're in this Empress energy, I feel like there's going to be a lot more coming towards you. And one thing coming towards you is somebody that's sneaky. I feel like somebody want to come in, back in. Oh, that was hot. <laughs> Dude, this is demon. I'm like, I don't know. I should have blew it first. <laughs> Let me put this back down, clearly. It's too hot to touch. Okay, but yeah. So right now with this uh, Five of Swords, I feel like there's some somebody that wants to come in um, and be a part of whatever this is that you're doing, Scorpio. Because I, I see massive growth. And it's like as somebody's trying to see which way to come in towards you, but they're doing it in a, in a sneaky energy. And this is because right now, I feel like something about you has really has grown since this person because you have all of this going on right now collective and whoever this person is you probably don't even have them in your mind's eye and this is somebody clearly you walked away from and i feel like they're trying to see how can they get back either how can they get you to want to walk towards them because in the past they were juggling and I feel like now it, it's something about what you're doing. This person wants you back in their world. Yeah, now they want a relationship. This person wants a relationship. This person, like, they'll win at any cost because cause this is in a past situation. I feel like this person could have been uh, dabbling with somebody else in the past. And now it's like they're they're still in this real toxic energy. And it's like they still could have somebody but still want to be with you. Because they feel like you're the star. And they want to offer you a relationship. They moving in slow. Yeah, because they see you're not focused on them. Oh, Lord. Spirit, what is this? What is these messages love like? Spirit, what is the Seven of Swords? Oh, girl, talk. Somebody did something. I feel like whatever they did, somebody wants to come in and talk to you about something. some Something that, that deal with somebody lying. And it says girl talk. So I don't know if this is you want to talk to somebody, which I'm like, no. Or maybe like a friend from the past wants to come in and talk to you about something. And I feel like you're going to be too busy because we have heart on the key. So there's a new beginning starting uh, Scorpio with you. I feel like you're about to get into a relationship really soon. And this relationship is going to be very much fruitful. There's people, friends and situations from the past that want to come in and talk to you. It could have been talking to you about something that could have taken place in the past. And this is because you're in this star energy. You're in this heal energy. Not just that, but it's something that you're doing, Scorpio, that is really like making you just sought out, sought after. People in the past want to be back friends with you and people in your present want to be down. And as you're trying to find out what's going to be your next direction, your next thing to conquer, because I feel like you're about to really come into a big mile of a of, of big accomplishment, of a big achievement, <laughs> a huge achievement. And, and, and I feel like in this energy, it's like, okay, what's next? Because for you, Scorpio, you're going to be like, okay, I finally got here. Man, that wasn't so bad. You know, you know how we be playing shit off. Like, 
after we done been through hell, it's like, well, shit, we went through it. So, you know, you can do it too. You know, we not really paying attention to all of the shit that we done went through. So the Spirit says we're going to get to this point of making a, a great achievement. And we're going to look like, dang, okay, time to do something else. You know, like, I got to get some more. And I feel like the people and situations that you walked away from are now walking back towards you. One more card for my beautiful Scorpios. Okay. Yeah, you walked away from this person. And uh, I feel like now you're dating or you're about to be dating somebody really soon. And then this is when these people are coming in, want to give you some type of love call. Uh, and you have self-indulgence. Some of these people are um, having healed and they want to come back in before healing. But I feel like, Scorpio, you're about to be dating. You're about to date, find somebody really quick that's going to want a relationship with you really fast. And then the past friends, I get a lot of friend energy too. So a lot of friends and associates will be coming back as well. We're trying to see if they can rekindle a friendship. But anyway, bye family. I love y'all. <laughs>